Hey everybody, Mrs. McGuire here with our Algebra 2 class. Um, this is my third year teaching Algebra 2 at Calvary. I've taught it before at other classes. I've taught for a while now and um, almost 19 years. Oh my goodness, now you know I'm pretty old. <laughs> but anyway, I love math. I love being here at Calvary. If you're new, extra welcome and blessings to you. But I'm really looking forward to this year. Um, one of the things that is a concern for this class, and I want to let you know up front as the parent, is that your child's prerequisite skills, the Algebra 1 class that they've already had and the Geometry class that they've already had, those skills have to come with them to this class. So if those skills are lagging, this class is going to seem extra difficult. And so you might have seen their summer work come home and it might have been a little low. That might be a good indicator that they might need to get a tutor right away or just make sure you send them to my Math Helps class. So with that said, I do have Math Helps class. It's on Mondays after school till about 4 o'clock right in my classroom here. Um, everything that you need is on our classroom bulletin board. The um, syllabus is up there if you want to look at it as a parent. But I tell all my students, um, your parents are not responsible for anything in this class for you. Um, the students are responsible for sure. And that's one thing that I really want to portray. These kids are older, most of them almost driving cars or driving cars around and going to college in the next couple of years. So to help them facilitate that independence and doing things on their own. I'd love to see emails from you, but I also would love to see it really um, pushed forward by your kids. So if you could have your kids send emails and then um, let them CC you on it, unless there's something special that you need to tell me. You know, you're always welcome to email me, but anytime you can put your child in that responsibility role where they should be is really the best way to train them for what's to come. But anyway, I am here for you and I am hoping and praying that we have a blessed year together. Thank you. Bye-bye.